Look, the door. Do you see that? That bloody door wasn't open before. Look, just simmer down, will you? There's a rational explanation for all this. Rational, my bleeding ass! You have a look! Ah, someone opened that door. The mercenary doesn't seem too happy about it. It must be Robert. This could be handy. Oh, this is not bloody good. I warned you I did. Shut it. This is position one calling. We've got a situation here. Over. Affirmative. What is your situation? The bastard got out of his prison cell. Are you serious? What? You think I'm clowning about making up random stuff while I'm on a paying job? Right. Attention, everyone. Clowny McButterfingers has let Robert Langdon out of his cage. Be on the lookout for a scuffy-looking English professor with a big sloppy grin on his face because he's just outsmarted us. I've got your number. I can hear you breathing. Now you know what I can do. What happened here? God, useless you are. Robert, thank God. It's all right, Sophie. I'm fine. Teabing, though. What has happened to him? Remy has taken him hostage. They're going to use him to bargain for the Cryptex. If we can solve it before they do, then we'll have more to bargain with. Have you found anything? Yes. Yes, I found something. An inscription on the fountain and another key. First things first. Give me a hand. Together we can open these heavy doors. Come here, we need to stick together if we're going to find them down here. It is rather dark. Well, why aren't the lights working down here? Try the light switch, you idiot. Light switch? What are you... We're in a sewer, you twit. The only thing even remotely easy to use are the controls for those gates. More trouble. There's a veritable army down there. Tweedledee and Tweedledummer, let's be as quiet as possible. We don't want them on to us. When I get back to Acne, I think I'll take a long holiday. This could be handy. Interesting. This isn't necessary. Not 
very sporting, I know, but I play dirty, me. I think it would be best if you... <laughs> Agent of the Judicial Police. Maybe they went the other way. Oh! No sign of targets here, over. Sewers. A freaking eight sewers. I suppose. Why are we even down here? If you were running away from a church filled with bloodthirsty mercenaries, present company included, would you run into the sewer beneath said church? Yeah, well, if I were a rat, I might. Well, for the purposes of this conversation, assume you're a human being. No, I most definitely would not walk into a smelly, dank, disgusting sewer if I were trying to get away from a bunch of bloodthirsty buggers like us. Unless... Unless what? Unless there was something really important down in the sewers. Like what? Your most favourite turd clump? Well, I don't know, maybe a, a wedding ring or something. Those two did not strike me as the married type. They were so stiff you could shove popsicle sticks up their rears and use them as marionettes. Lovely image. Thank you for that mental mind warping, you insidious bastard. I'm just saying, ain't I? They don't strike me as the married type. Look, maybe we should just do our jobs and watch these tunnels like the boss said. Fair enough. Do not make me hurt you.
I believe there is more to find if we keep looking. Another clue. The Templar were amazing architects. Let's see. A plaque. There's an inscription. For the Knights Templar, unfairly burned for claims of devil worship later proven false. May their shattered shield and reputation one day be reforged. Over here. It looks like something is missing. Fascinating. I think we need to search around some more. Nice job, Professor. Yes! Perfect. We need to orientate them a certain way. Which way, Robert? You're the professor. Which way do we tell them? Well done. The 
structure of the pillar goes all the way up out of the sewer into the courtyard. It must be part of the Templar pillar. That would make sense. The dedication on the fountain did mention it. Yeah. I knew a degree in symbology would come in handy someday. Do not make me hurt you. Let's go! Checking in. Over. You are dead when I find you. You're a tough one challenging me. I can hear you breathing. running about. <laughs> Hiding before someone comes looking. This job better pay ass is bleeding eye. and will defend myself. Just give up already. Get away from him! There's no shame in being... I will use force. It all could have been avoided if you just let me go. Hells on a lot.
We've got the metal shards. Let's get back to the shield. Why, what are you thinking, Robert? I've got an idea. <sighs> Robert. The shield, Sophie. We can use them on the shield. Don't make this difficult. Oh. Oh. You told me boxing wouldn't be useful in a teaching career. This isn't necessary. Have you had enough? They'll be all right. Well, here's one piece of the puzzle. Well, here's one piece of the puzzle. It's some sort of cipher. We just need something to decipher. I've seen these symbols before. Well, I do study symbols for a living, Sophie. Now, let's see. Clues to solving the grid? Of course. Question is, how? There must be more to find. The symbols along the top and sides seem familiar. I think we have the information we need to solve the cryptech, Sophie. It seems pretty clear, yes. What does the cliptic scroll say? In London lies a knight, a pope interred. His labor's fruit, a holy wrath incurred. <sighs> Dead people in London. That could be anywhere. I think we've all had quite enough of this running about. I'm too old. Give me the cryptex, and you may just walk from this. Really? Like the curator? You have no place to run, Dr. Langdon. You're a wanted man. Make it easy for yourself. And our beautiful Mademoiselle Nouveau. I'm touched by your concern, Remy. But I think we will have to decline. I am afraid no matter what you might believe, this belongs to me. Ah! Silas, get in! So run! Hurry up! You're not going to make it! Oh no. You see? God is on my side. And now your fate is sealed.
pathetic attempts to escape only anger God. The righteous are upon you. Hold fast and accept your doom. No escape from the hand of God. God. Seize your point. I hope Sophie's safe. Doom has come upon you. There is no way to run. Fools, only the blessed can know the path of God. Your time is at an end. You better get faster at this or I'm not gonna make it. No mercy for the wicked, the liars, the sinners. Yours is the path of destruction. What are you to God? A pathetic lying man, squirming in the mud and filth trying to run from your fate. Little game is at an end. Fall to your knees. Beg for the forgiveness of God and I might let you live. What a pathetic attempt. Did you really think you could stop the hand off? Yes. Who's pathetic now? Filthy murderer. Remy's orders. They must be holding tea being at Westminster. Let's go. 